Nesting Tips with Amy McGeechee is brought to you by Windsor Plywood, the experts you need to know. When you're living in a small space, it's really important to use every nook and cranny. This little corner over here was something that really kind of drew my attention to it. It wasn't being used properly. I took this really inexpensive IKEA bookcase and put some glass doors on it. We drilled two holes and put some fancy handles on there to really dress it up a little bit. Windsor Plywood cut some molding for the bottom for me, so it actually has a base mold on it now, so it looks a little bit more like a high-end furniture piece. To really accent the display pieces in here, I applied wallpaper to the back wall, which really sets things off, and it kind of brings a little accent of gold back into the space. With the open glass, I didn't want to use this as a functional storage space anymore. It's really more of a display case now. So I had to find an area where I could tuck things away and hide them. Just hiding all those books that don't match or board games and all those odds and ends. So I took the little area at the bottom of the stairs, which was really just wasted space, and created a nice narrow bookcase out of the same product line as this, but with solid doors so we could hide things away. I put a different style of handle on there, but still in the champagne bronze to tie everything together because it's in an open concept space. Flowform countertops cut us this Cambria Britannica quartz, and it really just finishes it off and makes it look like a built-in cabinet, as opposed to some inexpensive bookcases. It's all about having a functional unit, but having a real high-end look to it.